All right, so here's the real question then. I'm asking you, you know, these percentages which are hard to calculate, um, but you're telling me these are your best. So the question is, are you actually accountable? Or is someone in your organization? It doesn't actually have to be you, um, but they should be getting that to you because this is a big, huge portion of your business, the leads. So here's kind of a, you know, pop quiz for your best lead source, how many leads this month? And what I'm really asking here is, is that actually, do you know, you know, that best lead source intimately? Are you tracking it and trending it? Is it that important? For your best tactic for capturing the lead, what is the percent conversion on that? And some of that might be harder at the event, um, you know, how many people came by our booth or whatever. But each of these things that we want to measure. It's almost just for the sake of measure, uh, measuring them. So it's saying, I mean, obviously we do want to know and it's going to inform our decision, but really we want to know now just so that we can measure it again next month and see if it's going up or down to see if whatever actions we've taken or not taken are affecting it. You know, and you can dial that in tighter and tighter and tighter over time, but at a high level, that's why we want to know this. So do you guys know this? Um, and don't be embarrassed at all, but Betsy says yes. So do you know, and go ahead and throw it in if you know this, leads per month, the conversion rate, and then on your long-term game plan, what I want to know is what's the average number of days? So if you captured 100 leads in February, and you know that, awesome, uh, what percentage were not captured? Who could have been? Meaning what was your conversion? Uh, it's a different way to ask it. And then also, of those 100 that you captured in February, how many of them today are now customers? And then, let's see, that's been two months or so. How many of them in another two months will be customers? Another two months. And so, do you have numbers attached to these things which are really, really pretty, you know, fundamental in all your lead gathering activities? We don't want to focus too much. Like I said, you don't want to have only one thing and get lost, but what's working is working and so we might as well be measuring and trending at least it. Um, and I've only got one yes so far. Um, PJ asks how do you calculate that? Which one are you asking PJ? Uh, what else do we have? We have the numbers but they aren't in one great dashboard. We are working on our pipeline. That's from Betsy and then yes we did a Facebook promotion 28 day bikini ready body use Facebook ads produce 231 leads 11% opted in for free 8% went to the order form 7% bought. 150, okay, so Tim, tell me, I don't know how recent that was, but tell me what is your estimate on how many more will buy in the next, let's say, six months. And if you don't have one, that's great. It's just to point out that once you start tracking and trending this data,